everyone, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another episode of God of War. As always, I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Last time we left off, we were able to convince Mimir to talk to Jormungandr to get passage or to find a way to get to the realm of giants, which is where we need to go in order to scatter the ashes from the highest peak in all the realms. Problem there, though, is that we can't directly just go to the realm of giants. Apparently, it's not that easy. Not that we expected it to be, but, you know, it would be nice. We have to get some shit together, and then we can go to the realm of giants. So that's exactly where we are, and uh, I'm really excited for today's episode. I have no idea what lies in store, but um, I'm always down for a detour, so I've got a little happy energy drink. I'm ready for chaos. I hope you are, too, and without further ado... Let's get into it. So. Oh my. Uh. What is... Helheim? Ugh. Special chisel can carve the travel rune to Jotunheim. Serpent says that to get to the real highest peak, we need two things. The secret travel rune for Jotunheim and a piece of magic chisel to carve it with. First, we're sailing off to find the chisel. Helheim? Oh, there. Got another favor to ask you two. Oh? Is that where we have to go? Or did we just need to go through this little thingy thing? Also, the water... Lowered. So there might be more shit around here. What you got for me, Bubba? What do you want, Dwarf? I got another lead on my old pal on Bari. Hmm? Meet me at the Lonsuther Mines. There's some fancy dancy loot in it for you. Another lead? But we already found it. Well, found his hand anyways. <sighs> I'll explain it to mines. These ones is just south of the river pass. Now you two want something, or you just gonna stand there all gag scrapped and slack jawed? You You wanted to talk to us. Let's get to it. Pull the ring off on Vari's oh, hand at the Bellinger mines. Feller was always tampering with souls and dark rituals and matters of the night, see? Oh, so many things. Just the sound of his hammer flattening metal were enough to stoke my fires all blissful. Uh -huh. Shit, you better clear out before I get all frisky. Hey, yo. Crip of flame. Dude, these are all so cool. So I can only... I'm not going to do any of this. Muspelheim's Eye of Power. Stats and grants resistance to burn damage. Something tells me I'm not ready to go to... Helheim yet. A soft steel. Oh. Kid. You got something else in mind? I don't know. I don't know. I don't think I need any of these because I already use everything that I want. Please don't yell at me. Whatever. Dude, okay. I don't think we're ready to go to Helheim yet. All that armor and all those upgrades that are available. Mino thinks that's a good idea yet. So when we get to the boat, we can either look for that special chisel now or go exploring for a little while. I'm happy with whatever you want to do. Okay. Where is the boat? Uh. Am I tripping? <gasps> oh, okay. Huh. 
boat under the bridge, keep rowing towards the statues of the oars, then thread past between them. Forgot about him. What's that down there? So much has opened up. What is this? Hello? Whoa! Oh. Hello. Are, are you okay? No, son. My goods are underwater. My men are drowned, and yet their bodies continue to walk the beaches. Mm -hmm. Hell walkers. They plague these lands. I was their captain. Oh. They died because of me. Oh, the tea. But these abominations sully their memories. You want to kill I some zombies for you? I will find to free them from their tortured state. In this, I am determined. Kill the Hellwalker crew. The thunderstorm scattered all three of my ships across the lake. Oh. I know not what I did to anger Thor. But his judgment was swift and brutal. So, you want me to go and find all... Oh, Jesus. All locations where the crew is scattered. Oh, that's fun. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Yes, we got it. Yay. Boy, over here. And a scroll. Good haul. Oh, we got. Treasure map. Oh. Finder's fee. I've been working for Razla far more for a long time. But the pay is always short. Within the camp split between Vandred and his old man, no one noticed me a bit, stashing a bit of the earnings on my side. The secret purchase is the perfect hiding spot. That looks like... I know where that is. Looks like one of the little rocky areas in like the middle of the lake. Like over here. I think. I hear you. Ooh, I hear you. I hear that gosh darn bird. All we're missing is a few birds from the start. And then... The one from like the... Troll area. Where? Wait, no. I hear you. Here we go. Where the fuck? Oh. What? Oh. Oh, it's the serpent. Hi, buddy. What on earth? Where is it? Is it on the other side? Oh, that would be so mean. Yeah. <laughs> 
It's on my left. Dude. Where? Where? It's got to be on the other side. It's like right there. I don't know. I quit. Okay, this is going to drive me bonkers. I got to go. I got to go. I got to go. I got to go. I can't do it. I can't do it. Nope. I can't do it. Nope. I discovered opportunities for hunting and trade in these lands. I gave up my search for Jotunheim long ago. Leave oh. that for the younger, more hopeful men. But I was over eager. And my men paid a heavy price. For Jotunheim? You're telling me our boy's looking for Jotunheim also? That's where we're going. Boy. We're gonna have better luck than you did. What a sad story. Yes. Hopefully. We should help him. Really? You are surprised. Well, yeah. I didn't think you'd care about helping a spirit. Fighting more Hellwalkers is good experience for you. Oh. Ah. Oh. Ooh, this is fun. This is so cool. The water keeps rising and the new areas keep appearing. What is all this? We've done this before, right? Amir, you never did tell me why Freya spit in your face. Well, she blames me in large measure for her present circumstances, and not totally without reason. It all goes back to the long war between the Aesir and Vanir. Prior to that, wars for the Aesir were easily won, but the Vanir had proved their equal and exacted devastating damage. Both sides suffered tremendous losses, and for many of us, quite frankly, war was simply no fun anymore, but a rather senseless waste of precious life. Mm. Wouldn't you agree, brother? <laughs> Precisely. <laughs> enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. It took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy, a certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people. A selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story. Okay. So she got swindled into marrying Odin, and then she got cast aside. And now she hates them all. I can't really blame the lady. <laughs> Kind of fucked up. See you. Twenty-two of fifty-one in the whole game. There's only fifty-one in the whole game. Ow! It just hurts the sound of that. Little frogs. Hi, Jinky. We're not doing too bad, like, organically. <sighs> I am missing a few, though. And I don't like it. Hate them birds. Nice shot! What the fuck does this thing do? Oh, 
No jinx. Bro. Hi, baby. I can't see nothing. All right. <gasps> oh, whoa, whoa. Fuck. Okay, that worked. Where's the spellcaster? Someone was like throwing that stuff at us. Oh. Okay, there he goes. Easy. One of three. Were all those guys part of his crew? That's a tough crew. And all were his responsibility. That's a lot of responsibility. Does it frighten you? Uh. Responsibility. Oh, uh, no. I don't think so. I mean, I think it used to. But not as much anymore. Why is that? Well, being out here. With you. Up. Learning to survive on his own and just get shit done. Just like his father. Learning to be a go-getter. There's gotta be a fire somewhere to blow this apart, right? Oh, there it is. Oh my, it just keeps going. There's more. Okay. And more. Okay. Spiratelheim steel. Okay. 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 Oh. Is that a rift? What? Uh, okay, I don't think that's for now. Maybe. This is, I think, where the treasure map was. What I was talking about earlier. Around here, overlooking... What is that? There's like a pot in the wheel. Maybe? I don't know. There's something that looks similar to this. a lot to explore in this area. <laughs> Mir's breath. Rare axe pommel. Low perk activation to create a frost explosion on any successful axe hit. Protective barrier. I like the protective barrier one. Me gusta. Alright, let's go back this way and then rappel down to the other side. Zip line.
There we go. A rift, another one. Oh no. Oh, two birds. I, no wait. That's not a real bird. But this is. Where are you, you son of a biscuit? Unless it was another seagull. Wasn't there a bird here? Damn it. Ooh. A sap. From the tree of Yggdrasil. Oh. Oh. This is... Messy. Okay. Oh my god. A wolver. A dangerous beast. We will take him down together. Where? Oh. Oh. So I don't know what this elk thing does. Before. They look like they walk straight out of hell. Kill wolvers. Straight out of hell. Haha. <laughs> uh, yeah. What the fuck? Look like wolves stand upright like humans and are a lot smarter and stronger and faster. Their fur is so dense it makes them tough to put down. There might be a little of those berserkers that father put down last summer, but wolves instead of bears. Ha. Huh. Interesting. That was a fun fight. Heck yeah. I saw we had to climb up. A different way, but... I do want to check this out. How did this one captain lead so many men? He had their loyalty, so they followed. And then they all died. He must have been a bad leader. Why do you think that? Well, he led all these men to their deaths. True. But these men chose to follow. True. <laughs> Worshipping those who were created by another, I honor Bure, first among gods, from, and he from whom the Aesir sprang. I've left him tribute on the island that honors him. Oh. Bury. I have no idea. Even good leaders make poor choices. The mm -hmm. best take responsibility for them. Mm -hmm. Remember this. Being a good leader doesn't mean being perfect. <laughs> Taking responsibility for your actions, doing the best that you can. A lot of nuance. Okay, that's a uh, fire ancient. Any of those ancient stones? There we go. Okay. Love that for me. Love that for me. Oh my fucking god! Have you considered a tactical retreat? I had the worst positioning there. Did not mean to do any of this. Alright. 
So fucking annoying. I just wanted to pick up a stone and throw it in his mouth. Okay. I kind of hope I die in this fight. This is stupid. Fucking shit. Dude. English. That was a really bad setup. I feel like I was just like set up to fail. <laughs> By myself, obviously. Positioning, awful. <laughs> Getting myself cornered, also awful. Oh, I see now. They made this super sneaky. Oh, that doesn't damage him. Okay. My god. Did I pick it up? No. There we go. There we go. Now we're cooking. What the fuck does this deer do? Whatever it is. Can you... Here we go. Here we go. There we go. Oh my god. I just kept running into it. Oh my god. Get me out of here. Die. Huh, that was really difficult for some reason. Right? I thought so. Is that because it was a fire one? Heat off this one from the boat. I guess now we know what happened to all those broken ships. Okay. I was like, I've killed a few of those already. Fire sigil of focus. Increases resistance to burn by 50? Yeah, I'm gonna need some of that. We all need some of that. Cause... Yeah. No. There we go. I don't know why I was... Empty. Focus protection. Unstoppable aura. Yeah, let's get that back. Bunch of fire resist because we don't need that. It looks like. And an unstoppable aura. I'll take it. When did it end? Father. Were you ever a leader? I... Many years ago, yes. I led men in battle. Were you a good leader? It is... complicated. Did you no ever... No more questions, boy. Focus on the task at hand. Yes, sir. Mm. I'm sure that's a callback to the older games. And that's okay. Because I'll get to see it all when I eventually play them. I can't believe Odin and Freya were ever married. Yeah. Love and hate are more closely intertwined than you might imagine. For instance, Odin hates the giants and they him. But Thor's own mother was the giantess Fjorgun, one oh. of Odin's great loves. 
so Thor's half god and half giant? Where? Once Fjordrun was gone, lonely ages passed. And as war with the Vanya raged, he could see what he really wanted beneath his bluster. And after no small amount of convincing, Freya agreed. For a while there, he really turned on the charm. He seemed happy. He seemed interested in making her happy. He granted her so many wishes, I can scarcely recall them all. The peace held, and I truly believed all had worked out better than I could have planned. But Odin's true face showed itself again in the end. Oh, he won Freya's trust, and she taught him some of her Vanir magic. Mm. Another choice she would live to bitterly regret. Sadly, despite his wise counselor's best efforts to persuade him that peace was the only true path to stave off Ragnarok, Odin never let go of his obsession with Jotunheim. The taste of Vanir magic led him to new forms of experimentation and new levels of depravity. Oof. The thirst for more. The thirst for power. By all means necessary. Sorry, buddy. Damn. Half giant. Half god. Oh, Jesus Christ. Summon the deer thing. Level five, eh? We're gonna have to do this again. Probably not. Getting dicked on. You got this. That was the last ship. He definitely carried that. I hope the captain will be satisfied now. Unlikely. He was determined to put these men to rest himself. But he would have never been able to. That does not matter to him. Our victory will only remind him of his failure. Then, why do we do this? To help? Tears braziers. A symbol of the light that binds all realms together. Why would he use those strange runes, though? Now you mention it, he wouldn't. Oh. Who would? Why are they strange? Hmm. This needs a different cipher than the one we have. What? We just spent all that time getting the one language cipher. <laughs> You're telling me there's more? There's more ciphers? Oh, God. Oh god, oh god. I'm just kidding. I'm excited. Father, why did you really want to help the spirit? You need the experience. I've had plenty of experience fighting these things. What's the real reason? Hmm. This man inspired loyalty. He took responsibility for his mistakes. Oh, fuck. And he was determined to fix them. These are good lessons for you. Oh. Thing. Yes. Oh. What is that thing? Why are you here? Is that a revenant? There's two? We've already been here. What? We were just here. Why are they here? Has something changed? Hmm. 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 Oh, I didn't put this down. Would have been helpful. Did I forget a piece of loot down here? 
Oh my god. Hack silver. Ah. Es muy importante, ¿no? Очень важно. Oop. Any more sneaky special surprises? Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh. Was this always here? God damn, I was literally just in this area. And I missed this much stuff. What? This game's insane. I magically missed. There's that void over there. <gasps> Whoa! No way! Hell yeah! How do I get to the rift? Ah! Set complete, baby. Let's go. What are you? No, not that way. Oh my god, you can climb this? What? Oh, that's what we saw on the other side. Fire! There's a bird. I saw it. You guys see that? Dude. We were literally just here. There it is. How do you get to that bird? Is it this way? I don't even know if I can... Aim that far. I don't think I can. What do I know? Hmm. Oh, sneaky, sneaky. I see you. And you. Hell yeah. And then this somehow. Okay. Oh. A chest for later. Okay. Second one. One, two. Ah. Door? Three B. Focus oh, Jesus. up, boy. Hmm. Um. 
think I'm getting better at this. Okay. Health. Um. So much random stuff everywhere. Damn it. Uh, there ought to be one more of these. There's it's a W and a P. We. A W. I'm just missing a P. Huh. Hear you, bird. Am I in the wrong spot? Fuck that bird. I quit. I'm missing one more. The P. From here? Oh my god. Oh. That works. And it's probably literally just right here. I hate this game sometimes, bro. I hate this game sometimes. <laughs> Goes back to the same spot 20 times. I'm a dummy. We're gonna go from this angle.
even reach that far? Oh my god. What? I hate this game. I hate this game. No, I don't want to talk about it. No, I'm not okay. I'm fine. It's fine. I'm fine. She was, in fact. Not fine. What is this? There's something up there. Oh, it better be. There better be- better be good. Yeah? Some silver? Thousand? Seven hundred? 2,000 hack silver? All right, all right. What's in this? Want to give me something juicy? Oh! Mists of Helheim. A lingering area of effect attack that creates a small hazard that inflicts frost damage to all enemies. That's actually pretty... fucking good. Sure. <gasps> Pristine ore of the realm. Flow of stone containing a mixture of rare metals used to upgrade powerful armor. Only in the Iron Cove. Oh! We can only find it here. Okay, if that was worth the pain that I just went through. That was worth. It was self-inflicted, okay? I know. I know! I'm a big dummy. To the right, to the right. Hell yeah. We're not doing too bad. I do like the Iron Cove. I don't really have any complaints about sticking around here. I like all the pirate wrecks and uncovering the lore of what happened to all these people and finding all the resources. Honestly, this is pretty fun. I don't have any complaints about this area. I mean, to be fair, I thought this is what the whole game was going to be like. So my... Yeah, my expectations are like... Managed. We are chilling, having a good time. There was another ship right under the water. Also in that time, when we were hearing about all the lore, we discovered... A bunch of stuff about all the seeds. Yeah, like plus two vitality, plus two... What, another one? What's this way? This is the same area we were just in! We were literally just here! What's here? Oh, a rift! What's this? Oh, this is where we... Cypher? Dust of Realms. Nice! Okay! This is what I'm talking about. The same stinking spot has like 72 pieces of stuff in it. It's so freaking cool. Every time you go back, there's something new. Yeah, we got like plus two runic, plus two strength. 
plus two vitality. Obviously, the marriage to Odin didn't last. But how did Fran end up the hermit in the woods? Yeah. Oh, that was a singular piece of cruelty, even for Odin. As if the marriage wasn't punishment enough. Freya was better to him than he deserved. She stuck it out through all manner of indignity, all in the name of maintaining peace and safety for her people. But Odin's madness, his tyranny, his corruption of her magics, it became more than she could stomach, and at long last she broke it off. Odin's wrath was fierce, and his curses upon her were more than she dared to fear. But her magic was so much stronger than his. After so much time together, he knew her vulnerabilities, and exploited them to craft curses she could never break. Oh, like not being able to leave Midgard. Worse still, he robbed her of her warrior spirit. Freya cannot fight, even to defend herself. <gasps> no living thing may she harm by blade nor spell. That was like her whole thing. In a world this belligerent, what choice does she have but isolation? Yeah. Poor Freya. I guess if I was her, I'd spit in your face too. Aye, lad. So would I. Damn. That was like her whole thing. My, my men are, they roam no longer. They sure don't. That's right. We kill, uh, we laid them all to rest. We killed them I all. See. So even in death, I am a failure. Yeah, we kind of. But in life, you were honorable, strong-willed, and you inspired loyalty. Aww. These are good qualities, aren't they, boy? Yeah. I couldn't believe how many men followed you here. I... Aww. Thank you for your kind words. May your journey have a more pleasant end. Than mine. mine. Aww. Well, you're right. You didn't seem very satisfied. I guess you never really get over losing ones you care about. <laughs> never. No. Well. It's so rewarding to get to help, dude. How pretty is this? All the ocean and gold and stone and... Man! It's so pretty. Um... to go to the mines and help our boy with his quest. How much loot? Wow. It's like there was an entire city under the water. Hmm. My lad. A forgotten city. Oh. What was it called? No, uh, well, I forgot. Blame. Oh, why? Deus Ex Malachite? Come on! Deus Ex Malachite? I feel like we're gonna need a minute to travel to Muspelheim. The fuck is over here? The mirror. Oh. There was a shrine about a giant lady. Lots of books and, and visions. Ah, that would be Gloa, the mm -hmm. knowledge keeper. She was a gifted sorceress who gathered every tome of arcane wisdom she could find in the realms, all in the hopes of augmenting her powers of prophecy that she might find her lost husband, Arvandil. Mm. But it was not her husband she would glimpse in her visions, for it was Gloa, seeing longer and farther than any before or since, who witnessed Ragnarok, the end and the beginning. When Odin caught word of her ultimate prophecy, he maneuvered to obtain her knowledge and hoard it for himself. Mm. Groa knew Odin as a longtime patron of her services, and so she welcomed him into her library as a friend. And then he... What she did not know is that Odin himself was behind <gasps> her husband's disappearance. What? Having used his enchantments to conceal his death at Thor's hands from her sight. Smiling, jealous Odin took her by the throat. And with his very hands, he stole her library and her life for his own. Oh my god. I always knew Odin was bad. 
That's just... On a powerful seer slain by Odin, did he steal a book of visions? Called the Knowledge Keeper, girl was the first to have a vision of Ragnarok. She trusted Odin as a friend. Bad idea. Damn, maybe we should ride around with Mimir more often. Is he just gonna be around for a long time during the game? I don't know. Barbaric? Heartless? That's Odin. Damn. In fact, we would do well to sit here in silence for the next few moments and reflect on Odin's capacity yeah. for cruelty. God damn. And so reflect longer. <sighs> Alright. We'll pause his uh discussion there. Ruins of the ancient soul devourer. Maybe I should have more health for this. I'm not trying to kill this guy. Leave me alone. I just want to kill this bird. Bro! Hello? I just need some heckin' health. And I wanted to kill this bird. That's all I wanted. That's it. I'm a simple gal. Simple woman. With simple needs. Kill bird. But I guess I'll kill you two now. We already killed the fire guy, so this can't be much harder, right? I mean, it's purple. I see health. Stop looking at him. Move away, move away, move away, move away. Grab it, grab. Here we go. Nice, 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 nice. Holy dicks. Okay, that's way easier when you just throw a bunch of ancient stones on them. There we go. Brutal! Oh my. Cedar Sigil of Protection poisoned by 50%. That's good to have on hand. Ancient whose soul is removed by dark dwarven magic. It's stronger than a regular soul eater, and even those still terrify me. Soul Devourer. I was wondering. I was like, I don't think we fought one of those before. Still easier More. than the fire guy. Yes, sir. It's her dang sure. Oh? Make a contribution to Fafnir's connection and relics. I arrived at the door locked and reverse blocking the way I came. I quickly buried my treasure and hid as fast as I could. If I manage to escape, I'll return to this spot. Huh. Was that in the temple? We raided? There we go. Hey, it's a fragment of a language cipher. We should look for more like this. Niffelheim. Nippleheim. Hey yo. We got three more nipples to look for. Yo, pick your poison. Nippleheim or Milfheim? Ooh, what are we doing in here? Dude, it just keeps going. Northry Gorge. How big is this lake? Ed, you are full of stories. Yes. When will you tell one that entertains? I oh, thank your pardon? He just insulted you. Yeah, I got that. So you want a corker, do you? Very well, my brothers. I'll tell you the story of Hrungnir, the brawler. Hrungnir. The real story. I remember that name, there I think. It was a huge battle, right? 
His shrine had him in the middle, fighting off Aesir. A pretty story, but no. Hrungnir, you see, was born with neither head nor heart, so the giants had to complete him with stone. He was strong, to be sure, but also a perfect simpleton. Mm. Odin met him wandering in Midgard one day, found him so amusing, so harmless, so gullible, that he invites him back to his palace in Asgard. There he gives Hrungnir his fill of mead, and goads him into all manner of boasts and antics, all for the amusement of the court. I was there. I saw the Aesir laugh as Hrungnir leapt upon his shield and swore he'd kill us all and take our womenfolk back to Jotunheim. Then Thor shows up. And does he laugh? Oh, no. Thor takes one look at the drunken stone buffoon and brings down Mjolnir on his head so hard that he's got chunks of Hrungnir in his own skull to this day. Thor is so startled by the face full of rock he doesn't notice Hrungnir's body topple right onto him with a sickening crunch. And again, the roars of laughter echo through the palace halls. That's an awful story, Mimir. Nothing like the one's mother I don't know that me. was funny. Let that be a lesson, my son. Truth is seldom so pretty as myth and legend. A mighty giant made of frost and stone. Looks like he had a huge fight with Aesir in the Vanir Guards. He battles Thor and it looks like they both lose. Rugnir the Brawler, a head of stone but the mind of a child. Odin tricks him into getting drunk and rowdy in Asgard. Thor smashes his head but he ends up crushed and everybody laughs. Aesir are the worst. Yeah. We're not getting in there without a key. Hmm. Ah. Mystic Gateway. Okay. Yeah, it looks like we just need to go through this area. Got a little bit of fog left, but honestly, we're... We're not making off too bad. Accidentally covering the whole map. It's very easy for me to, like, mix exploration with the main story in this game. Although some areas might be more difficult and you want to like come back to them later, sometimes it's nice to just have a little bit of a challenge, you know? All right. This was a little foggy area on the map and it looked very difficult. This is like a whole ass thing. Light Elf Outpost. Oh, what's this? Oh my god, what is that? Crystals? Ready, Father! Not the corner. Not the corner. dance. It's all the dance you do. Hell yeah. 
It's magically locked. Another secret passage thing. You know, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know what this deer does. Like, what are what are we doing? You know? Energy as it walks? That's stupid. Well, I want my wolves back. Yeah. I want Wolfie. Wolves were... Absolutely smashing. CRN. Whoops. That was an accident. There's an R. Damn, this place is huge. C and an N. Whee! Avoid. I think I'm missing a C. What? Oh. Need more time. Leave my boy alone. Take the wolfies. And we got a little seal. A kiss from a rose on the grave. Ooh, more get a view the stranger feel, yeah. Ooh. What a good song. Now that your roses bloom. Oh, I see. I'm just gonna leave that there. We'll be out. I saw there was a creature in here, unless I already killed it. Okay, that might have been the thing we killed. Maybe. I'm missing a C. yourself purple nerd ah eh eh uh huh eh huh ah all the way up here eh how the fuck okay I see. It'll be up here, I believe. There we go. 
Now we're getting it. We need to find the sea. Chain reaction, buddy. Let's go. Heck yeah. Let's drop this real quick. Just a half. A C. And a seed over there. Oh. Hmm. Fire casters. Okay, maybe don't. Need more time. Maybe aim at them. There we go. Only one more. There we go. Now what is this? Huh. Um. Ah, yes. Come here, buddy. I knew I should have lit those from the other side, but... It's fine. We'll make do. All right. All right. Now that your roses are blue, the light hits the rose on the brain. Na 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 na. There is a little. I might have to bring it to the other side. Actually. And that's annoying. Mm-hmm. What is gonna be up here? Please be a horn or an apple. No shot. Okay. Bitter squirrel, spectral squirrel, Radats Ratatosker to unearth consumables. Oh. Okay. These are the light of Alfheim. Used to upgrade power form. Okay. All these upgrades are gonna come in handy when we actually have like good shit. Also. Put a little crystal over here. Yeah. 
Alright. Let's begin our trek to grab the crystal. Not a bad place to take a walk with a rock. Look at that view. God damn. All right. What is this going to possibly do? Is it going to lower something? Open something? Oh. Absolutely nothing. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. There's gonna be some purple ass boys. He's gonna be some fucking purple ass boys. Purple ass boys. God damn. I should have saved. Okay, this I might need to cut back for. I don't actually know if this is gonna be possible. Um. Lightning. We have some Spartan Rage. All right, fuck it. Completely ignoring the wolfies. in a corner, eh? Just like I did last time, buy a time until we can do wolves again. See? Triple attack, are you shitting me? Oi. Just bob and weave, bob and weave. Almost at the wolfies. Almost at the wolfies. Fuck. Hey! One hit kill? I actually wasn't doing too bad. They were all like at a quarter or a third health. I like my kiting tactic. I think we can do it. I think we can do it. Get some damage off ASAP. No, don't leave me alone here. Also, it would help if I had a res stone, which I don't. So. Oh my god. Can I get out of the way? This is not looking promising. Mid health. How did I do so well that one time? Vickens quickly.
Fucking shit. Fucking shit! Come on, get up, brother! I might need to come back. I think I can do it. I just don't want to spend 72 years doing this. But I think I could. Oh my god. Good start. Not my best work. Maybe even set up the burn damage thing I had. Frost protection? Yeah, I don't- I think I need to come back. We're gonna come back later. I don't- I don't think it's impossible, and I think that if I were to stand here and grind... We could totally do it, but... I just don't see the point... Right now, if I can just come back when I'm a higher level. So... All that to say... Maybe next time. Something tells me you're gonna get something pretty cool from doing that though, so that makes me excited. At least we were able to defeat the rest of this like dungeon thing. Which is pretty cool. Feeling pretty good about that. Uh, I just need to see where the ship is. Wait. Oh, yeah. Secret passage and high level enemies. Like, we'll come back there later for sure. Because we're once we unlock the fire, the not fire ability. I'm sure it'll all be cheese. What is this? Ah, uh, the ancient area. Come here. What can you tell me about that giant lady with the bow? She was called Skadi, Queen of the Hunt. Her father was Theotzi, who could take the shape of any wild creature and taught Skadi how to hunt them all. From the ribs of pack beasts, she fashioned second feet, allowing her to glide upon the snow so no animal could evade her. She became a huntress beyond compare, even to any god. Odin himself wanted her for his bride, believing she would bear him strong sons. But she spurned his affections, and for that insult, Odin vowed revenge. It was put forth that the Aesir were plagued by an eagle who would steal the precious golden apples of Idu. Not even the finest archer among the gods could bring it down. Odin knew that Skadi could not resist the temptation to prove herself superior, and so she joined the hunt. Mm. Skadi tracked the eagle as it flew where she alone could glide, and loosed an arrow from her unerring bow. When she collected her quarry, she found no eagle at all. But her own father, poor Theotzi, slain by his own daughter. Oh no. She was overcome with grief and shame. For there is nothing nature so reviles as a child who kills their parent. Skadi succumbed to her fate as winter's blanket fell, holding her father as the mountain held her in an embrace to last eternity. Well, that was sad. Aye. There aren't many happy endings for the giants, I'm afraid. Damn. What happened to him? Her father, Theazi, could take the form of any creature. Odin got jealous and tricked Scout into hunting an eagle that was Theazi in disguise. She is still out there somewhere under the frozen mountains. Damn. Odin is really something, isn't he? Really, uh... I see you. Really something. 
I wonder if we actually get to meet him. We probably will, right? I mentioned him enough times. I wonder who else we're gonna meet. We've met Freya. Point. Who else is on the docket, you know? What the hell is this? Oh! To where? Fight Traveler? Um... Oh. Not to be that guy, but he's orange. Mini boss, but... Plane tells me he doesn't really like uh, lightning. It doesn't matter for him. Ow. Frick! Let's just kite. Sure, destruction. Okay. A lot of fights today. God, I was not ready. I was like, oh, we're just gonna get the silly little seal. Have not even begun the whole seal thing. Like, I've just been exploring the new area. I told myself too before I started. I was like, maybe we just continue with the story for a little bit. Like, you don't have to explore all the new areas. Like, it's not that serious. Oh my god. Okay. Level seven. Oh my god, a werewolf. Two werewolves. Wolf on wolf. Violence. Yeah, this is not gonna, this is not good. I'm gonna need to wait. I'm not gonna be able to do this. Yeah, I'm great. Yeah, no damage taken. Yeah, no. 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 We're not doing that rift. Absolutely not. Nope. No rift for me. Nope. I'll just try this traveler one more time and then... Otherwise, we just need to freaking be on our merry way, bro. Maybe he needs the stun. Fuck. Not fair that he does this double shopping. Who the fuck 
fuck is this guy? Traveler from where? Ow! All right, one more time. <gasps> one more time. I need a rest stone. Traveler from where? What does he want? My God. Double strike, not fair. The double strike. Now I'm stubborn. I've only gotten him to like half health. He's only level five. Why is this so hard? I need a rest stone. seen these runes before, but it's the kind I still can't read. Whoops. Fuck. Got to a great start. I quit. Not right now. Nope. My level three ass armor. Nope. We're leaving. This is not for me. We're gonna have to come back here. What is this area called? Realm Terror Encounter. No. No. Not today. No. These fights are kicking my ass today. We're like 50-50. We got, we got some dubs. We got some L's. I think it's time to move on. Struggle. The struggle. All these new areas that opened up. King's Hollow. Oh. I probably shouldn't be here either. Let's be real. My god. That was the entryway fight. We can beach over here. Something tells me this is a really, really, really bad idea. Oh, thank god there's a shopkeeper. Oh, okay. Okay, I was like, we can't do this. We couldn't even do the- we couldn't even beat the bouncer, let alone get in the club, like... Not happening. All right. Take me home. Well, you gentlemen certainly know how to get around. I know I've been up on a mountain for a while now, but since when do the dead not stay dead? Yeah. <sighs> a little resurrection among friends is one thing. I can hardly complain, but it's as if hell itself is shambling into Midgard. Freya said the world was out of balance. That somebody meddled with forces. Oh, that's plain to see. And Odin is the king of meddlers. But I shudder to think what he did to cause this. But perhaps it involves the Valkyries. That'd be playing a dangerous game indeed. The Valkyries? Yannimir doesn't know why there are so many dead walking around Midgard, but he suspects Odin's meddling and maybe the Valkyries. 
Oh my god, Redstone, please, Odin, please! Not Odin. Our boy Brock. What's got you all bum fuzzled over there? Get going! Brock, please. I'm just gonna hold off until I can, like, buy all this shit. Smoldering embers? I guess I need to go to the... Son? What else? Thank God. Needed. I'm also only level three. I can just upgrade this for now. Level four chest. You hitting the road or chewing the fat? Did I upgrade the right thing? I always get so confused on the names of these. Plated pauldrons of focus. To work it is. Yeah, boy. Oh, nice. Upgrade five. Or me. Hell yeah. What more you need? Waste of focus. Nice. They have no other use on your journey? Oh! Sure. At least we got that taken care of. Think that was it? Now what was the other thing? You got anything for us, buddy? Said he wanted to talk earlier. Nothing? Nada? Okay. Alright. Mm. Oh yeah. Level 5? Stun damage. Shock damage. And greater number? Oh hell yeah. Massive shock. Greater chaining? Dude. R1 after a last second block. Sure. I feel like our shield game is weak right now. I don't want to charge a powerful stomp. Leaping attack. I still haven't targeted. Nice. Instant recall and attack. Sure. I don't know. 
just gonna upgrade a bunch of shit. Looks good. To me. good feeling good um that's the main area the mines how do we even get there maybe we'll do that Another time? I don't think those types of quests, like, expire exactly, so... I have a question. Hmm? If Ymir was the first giant, where did he come from? In the beginning, there was Ganungagop, the great boy. Ganungagop. There were no realms yet, only primordial forces. There was fire, and there was ice, and there in the void they met and produced... Water? More than water. The mystic lifeblood of something entirely new. From this water, Ymir took form and became a being of pure creation and chaos, mother and father to all that came after. Mm. Even the Aesir? Aye. Every god, man and beast came first from Ymir's flesh. Though it was the Aesir who thought themselves so superior that they should hold dominion over the rest of creation. Mm. It was Odin who took arms against his creator and spilled Emir's lifeblood with his spear. Yikes. A necessary evil, he would say, to bring order to the realm. And kill God. From Emir's torn flesh, Odin would fashion the realm of Midgard for his own. Called himself All Father as if he was the creator and not the creator's destroyer. First giant, things spring from his body, not just from other giants. Then Odin kills him, but where did he come from? Ymir came from fire and ice, and all the lands and creatures came from his flesh, including the Aesir, who then slew him to create order to take control. The first giant was Odin's first victim. A small, covetous tyrant. Ymir? Huh? Oh, sorry, my boy. Uh, you know, I think at best we just end it there, actually. Uh. Jeez. Learning more and more about Odin, eh? We need to come back here because there's a fire chest. We're just gonna have to re-explore the nine lakes every like two to three levels, huh? Please don't be scary. What the fuck was that? And there's a bird up here. I heard you. Son of a biscuit. Where you at? Give me that bird ass. Twenty-six of fifty-one. Whoa, we're halfway there. Knew it. Purple. Thank you. Good lad. Ow. Ow. Triple. Okay. okay nope. The only thing that kills these guys is lightning. Like, literally... Like... 
It's Atreus is carrying this entire fight. <laughs> TBH. Ooh wee. Dust of Realms, yeah, buddy. Seven of eighteen. We are not doing too hot. And there's a scary growly monster up here. Yeah, I always wonder what became of him. Fafnir? Fafnir? Like, Fafnir storeroom Fafnir? The very one. But Sindri said he was a dwarf. He was, and now he's a dragon. Funny how life works, isn't it? That is where the That's treasure the is. Up. That's what I thought. We should keep an eye out for binding shrines and free the poor bastard. Hi, lads. What? He looks dope. The bone hat, dude. This is the coolest dragon I've ever seen. I need more health for this. Eh. I'm getting smote. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, these guys are not super ha over level. That gives me faith. This is a chain. Did I destroy it? How did your friend become a dragon, Nick? Oh, he's no friend of mine. His throat was a constant source of annoyance amongst Aesir and Vanir alike. Why feed him? Trust the least we will ever hey. brother. No one deserves to be outcast of whiteness. And a greedy little dwarf can drag him. Found a shrine. There's another shrine. Help is fine. Done. Never answered the boy's question then. How did this dwarf become a dragon? Uh, yeah. Certain, though I'd wager his penchant for stealing magical artifacts had something to do with it. Must have stolen a trinket from the wrong Vanir goddess. Uh, I mean... In this world, dude, this is the coolest dragon I've ever seen! A poop. Get away from this guy. Same energy as the traveler. I don't like it. Absolutely no effect on this chungus. You shitting me? I use every single ability on him, basically. Here we go. See? Finally. 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 Come on, just fucking. Woo -wee! What do we do with that? We will show it to the doors. Crafting labor. Yeah, get him with that lightning. Ka chow! Yeah, get away from me. Time to set him free. Yep. Think he'll remember you? No, lad. A lot's changed since we last crossed paths. I had legs. <sighs> They're really strong armor, have huge swords, and are one of the toughest enemies we've faced. Who are they and what do they want with us? Mom never mentioned the travelers. I hope we don't have to fight too many of them. Well, this goes to show I can kill one. 
if so desired. Let's take this way. I think this way was much better. Fafnir, Fafnir, that's where the freaking um, treasure is. Ooh, I wanna get that one. Um, With the boar's head stuff. Oh my God, you shitting me? Another one. What is this Q-bone looking ass dude? Oh, there's multiples of them. What the? Oh my god. How long we've come since the first episode. And there's a dragon. That works. That's the last of them. Destroy, destroy, destroy. Yes, sir. Come on. Come on, boy. Cubone. Go, ya wee little bugger. We're just recruiting an army of dragons. Well, I think Dragon hasn't done much for his personality. <laughs> oh my gosh. Brilliant scale of the chain. Moderate perk activation grants a blessing of runic when using a runic attack. Flight of Fafnir. Wow! Two of three? There's only three in the game? <gasps> wow! We're actually doing stuff, y'all. That's exciting. Fafnir! Fafnir was a dwarf, one of the sons of Ivaldi, according to Mimir, but he was a very greedy and his, he was very greedy and his greed turned him into a dragon. It sounds ridiculous, but I saw him with my own eyes. He was a dragon. I wonder if it was painful to turn from dragon to dwarf. How long did it take? I have a bunch of questions for him, but he flew off before I could ask any. Wow. I actually feel really confident after that. I'm not gonna lie, this episode was kinda kicking my ass there for moments in time, like, it's been very, like I said, hit or miss. There's been times where I'm like, hell yeah, we're getting it. And then there's been some fights that I've had to just like learn when I need to walk away from them, which is quite humbling to be like, dude, I maybe actually can't do this right now or don't want to or whatever the case may be. Um, but that was a win. I feel good leaving off with a win. I am going to finish looting this area though. See what we got. Some more lore before lore. we, um, finish off here. Hold on. Let me read this. If you're reading this, go away. You don't belong here. This is my ravine, and don't touch any of my stuff on your way out. You're still here? I told you to leave. These are my treasures, and you can't have them. The best stuff is in my storeroom anyways, but don't even think about going there. That place is well guarded. I made sure of that. Just leave me be. I don't need you. I don't need anybody. Certainly not any of Evaldi's stupid sons warning me about the dangers of greed. I only need to look in my newly acquired veneer, veneer, veneer mirror to see what it does to my skin. But I don't care. My treasure makes me feel safe, and it warms me from the inside like the breath of a dragon. Get lost, Fafnir. <laughs> Lovely lad. Really uh, learned his lesson. There we go. Dangers of greed, eh? Hell yeah. Well, I think that's just about all the hack silver and runes and whatnot we can fit in our pockets. That That's about it, I think. Definitely was not expecting to free another dragon behind these doors in the Lake of Nine. 
Maybe there's only three and they're all in the Lake of Nine, because the other one was at the Dwarvish area, so... Maybe the last one is here, too. Hmm. Hmm. There's these. There's these. Hmm. I don't know. But either way, that was a really fun episode, if you guys can't tell. I'm having a blast playing this game. Uh, like I said, this episode was very challenging, um, getting to a lot of areas where there was definitely friction in which, like, I could not pass some of them, which is a good gaming and learning experience in and of itself, learning when, you, you know, picking your battles, quite literally, like, do I want to go after this? Do I want to keep trying until I get it and knock it out? Or do I want to take this with honor and step away and come back at a later time? So a great lessons learned episode today and also some great fights honestly and exploration of the map so in the next episode we're going to pick up where we left off maybe finishing off exploring what we can explore and then also continuing with the main quest so thank you all for watching thanks for being here and i will see you guys in the next episode see ya